Welcome to this PICA 8 training course. I'm David Bombal, and I'll be your presenter for this training. In this course, we're going to discuss a white box switching, and specifically PICA 8. Let me ask you a question. Why, today, in networking, do we still have proprietary hardware, proprietary software, and proprietary applications? If I asked you to do that in the compute world, in other words, buy a compute stack with proprietary hardware, software, and applications, you'd probably ignore what I'm telling you. In the past, when buying servers such as Sun Solaris, you were locked into a vendor with their proprietary hardware, proprietary operating systems, and proprietary applications. You couldn't move applications from one server to another. However, today, it's very easy to do that. You could write an application for Microsoft Windows, install it on a Dell computer today, and then next week move it to an HP computer or even to a virtual machine. So why aren't we doing that with networking? So why in networking do we still have a monolithic proprietary stack instead of using open standards? Well, with Picker H you can do that. In the same way as you can buy white box servers, these days you can buy white box switches from various vendors and then install an open Linux-based operating system on those switches. There's no need today to run proprietary operating systems on proprietary hardware. There's a trend in networking today to run open operating systems using Linux and even using open hardware stacks. On servers, it's very easy to install open source applications or update the functionality and applications available on a server by simply using apt-get update in Linux. Well, you can do something similar on networking devices today. Picker 8 allows you to run a Linux-based operating system in two specific modes, either as a layer two, layer three switch using protocols such as BGP, OSPF, and others in a data center, or in open vSwitch mode, where you can integrate your switches with OpenFlow controllers. In this course, I'm gonna show you how to integrate PICA 8 switches with controllers such as Open Daylight, Floodlight, and the HPE controller. I'll also show you how you can use a Junos type interface to configure layer two, layer three functionality such as VLANs, IP addresses, spanning tree, and BGP on PICA 8 switches. Think about it. Why are you using proprietary operating systems today? Why aren't you running Linux on your routers and switches? Well, there's a trend today with vendors such as PICA 8, Cumulus Networks, HP OpenSwitch, Dell, and even Cisco to allow you to use a bash shell for configuring networking devices. So let's jump into the new software-defined networking world using Linux, and in this course specifically, Picker 8 OS on merchant silicon switches from various vendors.